Within Bubble, there's only two ways to force an order with your workflow events. Otherwise, they all run at the same time. So let me show you how to do this. When you click on this button and you go into your workflow, you see that you have three actions. And again, all of these are running at the same time. All right. So there's no one, two, three at the same time. So in order to force an order and for one action to run at a specific event in the workflow action, what you could do is you can create a custom event like this. And within this series, you can use the trigger custom event. Now, what this will do is step one will, will run, then step two will run. And then it goes and finishes off all the workflows within the custom event. Then it comes back to the workflow and finishes off the rest of the actions. Now it's important to note that this only happens with the trigger custom event. If you were to use the schedule custom event, then this will run in parallel. So this also will run at the fastest time. So this will run, this will run, all this will run at the same time. All right. Now there's one other thing that we can do to force the order. And that's if, if we go into one of these and use a conditional of using the results of step, then it will require step one to run before step two can process. So those are two great ways to force order within your workflow actions in Bubble. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. And if so, please follow me for more.